Hi, my name's Claire O'Brien and this is a time lapse of a painting called What I'd Rather Be Doing. I'm using gouache paints which are an opaque watercolour and you can see me here blocking in uh, various lines and shadow picking out the motif of the witch. So in my head I've got the, the light direction coming in from the top right so all of my shadows are going to be kind of to the left and below. So that's informing where I put all of these marks. And my technique that I'm using here I learned from the Famous Artists course and it is to block in the darkest tones first so that's often your outlines and your shadows and it as it blocks all of that in immediately your painting your image your motif whatever you're working on just appears there on the paper and it's kind of like pretty much done really and if you work this way as well it's very controlled with your tone because it means that you know that you can't go any darker than these colours. Technically I could use black here but I didn't. I, the darkest tones in this painting are the blue of the, the clothes and the dark brown of the tree stump and the kettle. So yeah this, this painting's um, it's a, a self-portrait kind of a, a wish fulfillment or a spell even with it being a bit witchy. It's um, a self-portrait as a witch in the forest painting en plein air with gouache probably and uh, drinking a lovely cup of tea out of a old-fashioned copper kettle. I absolutely love wearing Breton striped tops like the, the French sailors or onion sellers um, so that's a little bit of a motif for me as well as the witch of course. I don't often do paintings for fun really but when I do they, they turn out really well and this one just came from this sketch from this desire to to be an artist really I just had this I just have this desire that I'm not using my art enough I'm not being the artist I could be um, I focus more on my teaching and I just would like the balance to shift a bit as I get older so this is kind of a visualization as I say kind of a spell of what I'd rather be doing so that's the title of the painting what I'd rather be doing and oh hang on a minute here's a mistake here I've just got some yellow on my hands some yellow paint on my hands from the, the um, palette and I've mixed it in there and you can see I painted over it and you pretty much can't see it there in the end as you can probably see I've done something wrong here. I've I've started without a background. So I quickly knocked one up and it then I thought, right, okay, if I'm gonna make a print of this, let's put it in Photoshop. And I brought it into Photoshop and I usually make my prints A4 size and it didn't fit, so I had to extend the sides. I copied and pasted parts of the image and flipped them and put them in on the sides and with you pretty much can't see them. Um, it might need a little bit of touching touching up if I zoom in but um, that did the job and then I had to do a little bit of colour correction. Um, the, my portrait there is a little bit brighter than I normally paint um, but I, I like it. it. It adds to the the joy of that this image brings. So yes thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed that. Head on over to my website check me out join my mailing list like and subscribe here on youtube or give me some likes on instagram and i uh, look forward to hearing what you think thank you bye